Ollie, it's not looking good. Has he got a cold, Stan? Worse than that, it's his voice. Sing us a note, Percy. Uh... <coughs> not good, Stan. Is there anything we can do? No singer, no gig. Percy's the star of the show. Hmm, well, perhaps we could find another star. Hey, I've got a plan. But, Ollie, what are we doing here? We're here to find a replacement singer for the band. Now, let the auditions begin. <coughs> um, thank you, Mayor. <laughs> that was, um... Smashing. Next! <coughs> Down on the farm, ties deep in mud. I'm happy as a cow munching curd. Yee-haw! Oh, 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 that ended with a bang. <laughs> Next! Next. What a downer. I can't take much more. How about that cup of tea? I'm on it, Percy. Be right back. Could I have a cup of tea, please, Alice? Coming right up. Who's that? Who's that? I'm a big red fire truck. Oh, Royston, it was you. Come on, you need to audition right away. Audition? For what? Next. Go on, Royston. You can do it. Hold on tight, cos Royston's about. I put on fires, there's no doubt. It's an emergency, but you're in luck, cos I'm a big red fire truck. Well, what do you reckon, Percy? Yeah, man, he's got it. Star power. <laughs> the daylight robbers are back to rock you. We're here to move you, to groove you, to get you dancing. Are you ready? Are you ready to rock? One time only I'm here to sing Until Percy comes back to you Thanks to Holly we can rock tonight With a daylight robber crew Stop, stop, stop your feet Clamp, clamp in the beat Shake down, turn around Jump up and touch the ground Oh, that's better Back on stage where I belong I've been left out in the cold <laughs> But with Royston hissing clear We got bumps and rock and roll What do you say? Stop, stop, stand your feet Clunk, clunk, keep the beat Check down, turn around It's the day I draw the sound Royston, I might need your help here. Nobody panic. Royston's got it under control. Back to the day job then, eh, Royston? <laughs> Good about that, eh? Uh, here's another one, sir. Chop, chop. We've got five more to collect before lunchtime. Oh, what are we going to do? Do. How are we going to go on holiday now? Beep, beep. Ollie's bus service at your service. Bus, bus service? service? I thought I'd help out by being the best bus in Bumpton. Hey, Ned, this means we can go to the beach after all. Oh, sure. Out the way, out the way, van at work, van at work. You are looking at Bumpton's newest bus service. Who needs a ride? Baza, but I'm the new bus service. You? Pfft, oh, do me a favour. I'm all kitted out and everything. Oh, and I suppose you have comfy seats and all. Here, you two, hop in. I'm not sure they're going to want to, Baza. Oh, yeah, we'll see about that. Come on, Ollie. Best fan wins. <laughs> What do you think, Meg? Um, I think we'll take the Ollie bus. Sorry, Bazza. Oh. <gasps> oh! Oh, whoa! No way, man! We just missed the Ollie bus. Ollie bus? Pla! Try the Bazza bus. Hey, hop aboard, and I'll give you the ride of your life if you can handle it. Oh, we can handle it, Van. But can you get us there? Oh, I'll get you there, man. I'm gonna be the best bus in. 
nice to meet you. I'm Ollie, and uh, this is my friend Bertie. Oh, uh, hello. I, uh, oh. What's your name? I'm Betsy. How are you enjoying Bumpton? I haven't really seen so much of it yet. We've been so busy since we got here. I know. Um, Bertie here would love to give you the grand tour if you like. I would? Um, oh, yes, I would. That's a great offer, guys. But I can't really leave the rides at the moment. We'd be a car down. Unless you'd like to take my place. <laughs> Me? I couldn't. Could I? Well, yes, I'd love to. Really? Great. Well, Bertie, what are we waiting for? Let's go. Hang on, Betsy. I don't know how to be a bumper car. What do I do? It's easy. Just drive around. Have fun. Oh, but just remember, no bumping. What did she say? No jumping? Why would a bumper car jump? Oh, well, it can't be that difficult. Come on, you two. Woohoo! <laughs> oh. Oi, you! No bumping! No bumping? Health and safety, mate. It's all about dodging nowadays. All oh, right. I must say, you're quite the tour guide. Oh, well, um, it's my pleasure. I'm having a lovely time, Bertie, but I think we should probably head back to the fun fair. I wonder how Ollie's getting on. Oh, we'll be having a blast. <sighs> oh, Ollie, it's been years since I've been on the bumper cars. I might be a little rusty. Come in, please. You look exhausted. Oh, oh yeah, I am a bit. Oh, being a bumper car is exhausting. Now it's easy. Best job in the world. Anyway, I better get back to work. Thanks for showing me the size, Bay. I had a great time. We should do it again. Really? Oh, yeah, that would be great. How about next week? I'm sure Ollie wouldn't mind taking your place again. Um, yeah, sure. Any time. Same time next week, Ollie. Now I've blown away the cobwebs, we can have a proper drive. A proper drive? What do we do today, then? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Panache! It's the end of the road for you, Professor Claxon. We'll see about that! You need bringing back down to Earth. You and your ingenious gadget. Whoa! Yeah! The best movie ever! Hey, Ollie, you'll never guess what. Auditions for the next Spy Master film are taking place tomorrow morning at Bumpton Studios. Wow! A chance to act alongside the great Quentin Panache. Yeah, and Brian Palmtree, the famous director, is going to be there too. He'll give me a part, no messing. I'm a natural born actor. Bazza, did you get the part? Now, Lee, Mr. Palmtree said he wouldn't even use me for spare parts, let alone a part in the movie. He said it was the worst actor I'd ever seen, and my paintwork needed touching up. That's not very nice. Give me a minute, Bazza. Mr. Palmtree, you've got some nerve talking to my friend Bazza like that. You should be ashamed. Stop right there. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Perfect? You are perfect for the part of undercover agent Oliver Vanquish. Look, uh, really? Yeah, I'm gonna make you a star, kid. It'll be movie magic. Hey, up, you must be Ollie. Grand dare to shoot a movie, eh? You sound completely different. That's why they call it acting, me lad. Now, little van, let's see what you can do. Take one and action! 
I think Klaxon's on to us. You go, Quentin. I'll handle this. Out of my way, Vanquish! You're going nowhere fast, Klaxon! Oh, what? He what? Cause she's singing about things all around me. Cut, cut, cut! He's ruined the shot. Take two. Action! You're going nowhere fast. <laughs> Anyone for an ice cream. Cut! This can't be happening. Take three. Action! You're going nowhere. Else. Cut! That's it. I've had enough. I quit. Well, lad, unless we can find someone who's bossy, loud, and a genius, this move is finished. I can help, Quentin. I'm not sure he's a genius, but I know someone who's loud and very, very bossy. Oh, shucks, Susie. That don't sound good. I just don't know what's wrong with me. You're not the only one, Susie. Half the town has broken down thanks to Baz's spicy soup. Tommy, can you bring them all back to Mick's garage at once? Ooh, I don't know about that. Only got one hook. See? I'll have to take them one by one. Oh, we need to get everyone back to the garage to get them fixed and back on the road right away. Hang on a minute. I've got an idea. This is a great idea, Ollie. Oh, it sure is. I can pull all the vehicles at once like this. <laughs> it's a convoy. Stan, you stay and help Tommy. I'll meet you back at Mick's garage. Hey, Stan. You know what I like to do when I'm working like this? I love nothing more than whistling a tune as I ride. You don't mind if I whistle a little now, do you? Oh, be my guest, Tommy. of yours to tie all the vehicles together, Ollie. We've been hard at work too, Tommy. Yeah, we've made you something to say thank you. Now, hang on. It's not any of that soup, is it? No. I helped Bazza to make you a super juicy fruity smoothie. Yeah, don't worry, Tommy. It's Ollie's recipe. I did put some smelly cheese in it, though. Ew. Nah, I'm only joking. Come on, Bazzer. I think you've done more than enough joking around for one day. You can help me repair all these engines. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> After polishing off me sardine lasagna, they started on me cake. And then they gobbled all that down, too. And as you can hear, I don't think they're feeling too good. Too much cake. Oh, blazing bonfires. We need two replacement firefighters, and we need them quick. Hey, Royston, I could lend a wheel or four. And I could lend a hand or two. Oh, brilliant idea. Come on, let's get you boyos fitted out. Stan, report him for duty. Can I test out my water jet, Royston? Oh, be my guest, Ollie. Be my guest. Oops. <laughs> Sorry. Don't worry about it, Ollie. But perhaps we should do a bit of training first, eh? Behold, the Super Jet Fire Simulator 3000. To pass this test, you must squirt down all of the fire targets. Kevin, water on, please. <laughs> Let's try that again, Stan. Rose, if you could lend a hand. Yes, boss. I think we did it. Boys, what can I say? You were super. Woo! Wake up, everyone! Go, go, go! There 
there's trouble at the farm, boys. Right behind you, Royston. Fire. There's a fire. Fire. <laughs> All the parts of fire. Right, oh, boys, we got to tackle this fire as a team. Everyone ready on my mark? Go! <laughs> See you next time. <laughs> What's the story here, Meg? Oh, my precious crocky. It's up there, look. It's stuck in that drain pipe. Should we use the ladders and go to him? Or the giant cushion and get him to come to us? I've got an idea. One big deep breath and... <gasps> Gotcha. Oh, thanks so much, Ollie. It's another clue. Well, what does it say? Journey to the far corner of the big green eight. So how are we going to find that? Well, there's lots of green around. And there's our big eight. Well done, Charlie. The big green eight is the hedge around those two fields. Let's check it out. I'm telling you, Jethro, that dot way up in the sky is a bird. <laughs> Aren't I tell you for the hundredth time, it's a plane. <laughs> Actually, it's a fly. What are you lot doing here? We're on the hunt for clues to pirate treasure. Treasure, eh? Got it. Follow the silver S between the camel's humps to the treasure of the golden crescent. Camel humps, eh? Hmm, must mean the local zoo. Whoa, smart thinking, Bazza. We'll find that treasure in no time. Ha, no chance. I'm off to grab that treasure for myself. Laters! Ha, ha, ha! Not so fast, Mandy. I don't think the zoo has the only camel humps around here. What do you mean, Charlie? What do those look like? Oh, camel, camel humps! humps. <laughs> <laughs> Poor old Bazza's got it wrong again. Come on, you. Out. <laughs> but, but the treasure. Don't come bothering my camel. I told you, she ain't got any gold or silver S's. Ah, I think you were right, Charlie. And this stream is the silver S in the clue. <gasps> Which means there's a crescent made of gold just around this corner. I guess the beach is crescent-shaped and the sand is golden. Congratulations! You two have solved Ollie's treasure hunt. Ollie's treasure hunt? Yes. While we were busy in the garden, Ollie thought it would be a great way to keep you two amused and having fun. Brilliant. That was so much fun, Ollie. Yeah. So, there isn't really any treasure? The real treasure is spending time with friends and family, Charlie. Oh. But it's also having a barbecue, ice cream and football on the beach. Hey! Well, hey. Thanks, Thanks, Ollie. Ollie. <laughs> worries, everyone. Uh, over here! On me, Ed! Come on, Jethro. Oh, I know I don't look my age, Ollie, but I'm an old tractor now. You're a great tractor, Jethro. But Milford's even got a CD player. I can't compete with that. Hey, I've got an idea, Jethro. Uh, I'll be back soon. <laughs> Jump in, Stan. We've got a friend to help. Let's go. Beep, beep. Right, Milford. We need to round up these here sheep and take them back to the farm for their monthly bath. Now, which one to press? There's so many. Jethro only has two buttons and one of them to work. Milford, do you know how to round up sheep? There's an instruction booklet under the seat. K didn't you read it first? Word. Right. Sheep, sheep, 
sheep, sheep. Oh, I can't find anything about sheep. What about this one? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, no, maybe not. Steady, steady boy. Oh, 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 stop. Oh, I can't wait till Jethro sees what we've got him. He'll be so excited. What in Bumpton's going on here? Hey? Ollie, fetch Jethro! Quickly! <laughs> oh, Jethro, am I glad to see you. That tractor was out of control. The sheep are all terrified. Do you think you could help round them up, old pal? Of course, Dan. Rounding sheep up isn't about speed technology or flashing lights. It's about teamwork. Come on, Ollie. Let's get to work. Here come, boy. Beep, beep, sheep. Well, I'm glad that's all over. I can't see what all the fuss is about with these modern tractors. Although I must admit, it was right marvellous having a CD player. It's not just modern tractors that have them, Dan. Take a look at Jethro. Wow! It's a CD player! Come on, Dan. Let's get these sheep back to the farm. Sorry, Stan. Don't worry, Ollie. This has given me a great idea. Um, Stan, what are you doing? Oh, just you wait and see, Ollie. <laughs> that tickles. Thank you, everyone, for coming to the Bumpton Flower Fair. <laughs> it's time to find out who will receive the Golden Trowel Trophy. Let's find Bumpton's most beautiful flowers. Oh, lovely, Miss Florette. Flowery, fruity, fantastic. Terrific tall sunflowers make. Oh, you haven't seen anything yet. <laughs> oh, bravo! <laughs> Very clever. <laughs> the trophy's ours. Nothing can stop us now. Wait! I'm coming! Sorry I'm late. Oh, can I still enter my flower display? Of course, Dan. But where is it? Everyone, please put your hands together for Bumpton's first ever flower van! <laughs> Hello, everyone. Marvellous. I think we have a winner. Dan, congratulations. Thank you so much. But I couldn't have done this without a little help from a friend. <laughs> He's always there when I need him most He always tries his best, he does what he can I've got the best, best friend Of that I can boast Where would I be without my little white van? Ollie, you're Bumpton's best helper The most helpful van the town's ever seen Ollie Bumpton's best helper, Ollie and Stan Wallace. Oh, thanks, Stan. See, I told you that you were the best at something, helping people. Ollie, he's Bumpton's best helper, the most helpful man the town's ever seen. Ollie, he's Bumpton's best helper. Ollie and Stan. What a team. Oh, <laughs> hi, Bazza. What are you doing here? Oh, um, yeah, I need to get into the wonderful washer. Whoa, Bazza. 
You know no one can use it till the morning. Stan said so. Uh, yes, but he also said he wanted me to give it a wash. Really? Oh, yeah. He said, Bazza, Bazza, he said, please wash the washer. Wash the washer? Oh, yeah. Someone has to wash the wonderful washer. I'm not sure. Oh, come on, Ollie. You wouldn't want to let Stan down, would you? Well, no. You but can I... help me wash it too. OK. Let's do it for Stan. I'll open the gates and you can get the ah, Wonderful washer. Here I come. No, a Bazza. Oh, you tricked me. I'll stop worrying, Ollie. Let's ride the roller coaster. Bazza. Come back. Here we Go. Up and down and all around loop the loop Up to the sky and to the ground This is where a van can have some fun Get washed and dry The wonderful washer It's a roller coaster ride This is great fun I really gotta say But how do we stop the button? Too far away. Do you mean we're stuck on here? I guess so. Smile. This is where a van can have some fun, get washed and dry. The wonderful washer. It's a roller coaster ride. Ladies and gentlemen, vans and vehicles, I present the wonderful what? Ollie, what happened? I told you not to go on the ride without me being here. It was my fault, Stan. It was my idea and Ollie tried to stop me. Sorry, Stan. Oh, that's all right. As long as you're both OK. We'll help you clean up, Stan. I'll clear up all the pictures and, Bazza, you can wash the washer. Me? Oh, no. Not more washing. Of course. <laughs> Someone has to wash the wonderful washer. <laughs> right, now can we play volleyball? Oh, later on, Suze, eh? Hey, watch me! Watch me! Oh, what now, Bazza? I'm the strongest man in town. Did you know that, Susie? Uh, come on. Uh, oh. I think you eat far too many ice creams. You are so out of shape. Oh, yeah? Well, I'll show you. Bazza! Oh, he promised we'd play volleyball, but all he ever wants to do is laze about or show off. Well, I'd play volleyball with you if I could, but I've got to get back to my ice skating lessons. Oh, it's not really about volleyball. I just need my exercise. i got to keep fit and healthy. Why don't you come skating with me, then? It's great exercise. Oh, yes, but... No, you see, I can't ice skate. Don't worry, I'll show you how. Come on, Susie. Right then, the most important thing is keeping your balance. Whoa, easy now, Ollie. I ain't never done this before. No, uh, don't look down. Uh, look at me. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's right. Keep it steady. Oh, that's it. You're getting it. Woo! This is great, Ollie. Skating away on ice together. Oh, happy day, can it last forever? Look at them go, a wondrous sight. Twisting and turning, jumping in flight. Skating away on ice together. Leaping through the air as light as a feather. Oh, this is such a wonderful feeling. Never thought I'd do it. But seeing is believing, skating away. On ice together. Oh, happy day, it must go on forever. Oh, thank you so much, Ollie. That was amazing. You really are a true friend. Mwah. Oh, oh, oh. Look, he's almost as red as I am. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
Oh, what problems, Gaffer? Hey, Royston, I don't suppose oh, you have Oh, not a... now, Ollie. This is critical. Uh, Royston? Ah! Oh! oh! We'll need a new one of these, Gaffer. We'll have to throw this one away. Hey, Royston, can we have that old hose pipe? Well, yes. It's of no use to us, is it? Thanks, Royston. So what fancy dress costume are we going to make with this lot then, Ollie? Well, I thought we could team up and go as a spaceman and a spaceship. Oh, wow. What a great idea, Ollie. Come on, let's get to it. And now my space costume is complete. Right, let's get to that party. Hold on to your helmet. We're taking the cosmic route. We're on a space mission to reach that party soon. There's a fancy dress party on the bright side of the moon. On a space mission, past Jupiter and Mars To get to that party, we'll rocket beyond the stars Ollie in outer space What an amazing place And I'm so glad you're with me I am Robotron from the Teapot Nebula, and this is my spaceship Ultrabox. Take us to your leader. <clears throat> That's me. So, you, you have, have taken, taken over at last, I see. Good, good. What is it you want? We come in peace. We've just touched down to party. <laughs> it's only us. Ollie? Stare? Oh, my! You had us all fooled. What great costumes! Yes, they're the best costumes ever, and it's all thanks to Ollie! Come on, let's get this party rocking! Ollie, the little white man, helps his friends as much as he can. Ollie, the little white man, always around to give a helping hand. I don't know what's the matter, Ollie, but we got no one to buy our lovely lollies and ice creams. It's a disaster. Hmm. Hey, you might find some customers down at Acorn Park. There's a big statue being unveiled by the mayor. Stop lying about, Mario. Let's go. Thanks a lot, Ollie. So after putting out that big fire, what we really need is to relax and cool off. It's just too hot. I know what you're looking for, Royston, and you'll find it at the big statue unveiling in Acorn Park. Thanks, Ollie. What's the statue of? No one knows. It's a surprise. Oh, I love a surprise. <laughs> Don't worry, Farmer Dan. We'll find someone to pull that milk churn off your head. Hey, oh, hey, guy! Shh, Oli, it's the big statue unveiling. Thank you all for attending the grand unveiling of a brand new statue, and it's with great, great pleasure that I present to you <gasps> me, Oli, the most helpful little man in. And I think we can all agree on that, right? The practicing starts, we knew where to go. When we were bored, he gave us a show. 
He told us where it's best to sell the lollipops And when we had to cool down, all he was tops And you made the unveiling a smashing success So that's why we say Ollie is the best Ollie the little white fan Helps his friends as much as he can Ollie the little white fan Always around to give a helping hand Ollie the little white fan Helps his friends as much as he can Ollie the little white fan Always around to give a helping hand Does this always happen? Oh, 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 and now we're winning! Woohoo! Move aside, Buzzer. Let's crash her through. Yeah! <laughs> Eat my dust! in a spot of bother. Maybe I can help. Jethro! Better late than never, eh? We should see the races any time soon, folks. And yes, it's, it's Jethro, followed by Ollie and Baza. Oh, and Jethro wins the Bumpton Rally! What a surprise! What an attractor! What a friend! See, I told you being the fastest isn't everything, boys. You were right, Jethro. Thank you. Well, Bazza, we might not be the fastest, but we certainly win at something. What's that? We're the muddiest fans in town! <laughs> What's that? Oh, what's that? That'd be me, Ollie. You want to see a bird, you've got to sound like a bird. Nice and peaceful-like. I see one! I see one! Look! On the fence over there! Careful, Royston! You're scaring the birds away! Oh, no! They've all gone! Well, not all of them, Ollie. The one I spotted is still there. Look, oh, I think it's a chaffinch or a budgie or maybe an old rag hanging off the fence. <laughs> well, don't worry. We'll just wait here until the birds come back. Mm. Well, not while they can see old Royston here. Old bright red and that. <laughs> oh, Jethro's right, Ollie. I'm too loud and too colourful. I don't blend in enough to go bird watching. You make a good scarecrow, though. <laughs> Hang on. Royston, stay there. I've got an idea. Easy, Ollie. What are you up to now? <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's not very nice, Ollie. <laughs> Don't worry, Jethro. Oh, I think I know what Ollie's doing. Hey, <laughs> you're blending now, Royston. Ah. 
Thanks, Ollie. Now I... Now I really blend in with the woods. So let's spot some birds. <laughs> Sparrows and blue tits, it's birds that we spot. Cuckoos and magpies, we see such a lot. Chaffinch and robins, all up in the trees. A dog on your back, beware you don't sneeze. <laughs> some thrush and blackbirds are making a nest. Woodpecker, skylark, but spawning is the best. Whoa, that was fun! Thanks for helping me blend in, Ollie. You're welcome, Royston. I've had a fantastic day. But look! How are we going to get clean? We're completely covered. Don't worry, Ollie. I've got a few good friends who can help us. OK, boys, let's get them clean. <laughs> oh. Ollie, the little white man, helps his friends as much as he can. Ollie, the little white man, always around to give a helping hand. Put the band back together! Flowers and birds and ponds and trees dum de li um dum do. Hey, it's Percy, my old friend. It's really good to see you. Stan, yeah, it's been a long time, man. We're putting the band back together, Percy. But this time, it's an emergency. Oh, wow, Cosmic Dude, count me in. This, my voice is as good as ever. Listen. Ah. Now, hang on. We're missing something. What's that, Percy? Every good band needs a good, solid tour van. And every good band needs a good band. Beep, beep. I'm ever so sorry, guys. I've dreamed for years of picking up my bass guitar and playing in the band again. But all these beetroots are needing harvesting, you see. <laughs> well, we know what to do, guys. I'm on it. Let's go! Or I'd love to do them play drums in the band, fellas. But I've got to juice all these apples, you see. I'm ever so sorry. Guys, I've got an idea. Thank you, everyone, for coming. <laughs> now, let me introduce the band. We are the Daylight Robbers! <laughs> oh, yeah! It's time to come together. All he had the plan. It's good to help each other. He's the man that can. It's time to sing together, cos he doesn't need repeating. Lots of tickets sold, those kids just need some eating. It's time to man together, can you feel the beat? It's time for rock and roll, that boiler's obsolete. Thanks ever so much, Ollie. You are a true legend. Thank you, everyone. None of this could have happened without... Ollie, the little one man, helps his friends as much as he can. Ollie, the little one man, always around to give a helping hand. There you go, Ollie. All done. Oh, thanks, Mick. Beep, beep. Bessie, what's up with you? Oh, well, don't get me started, Ollie. I've got a rusty door, I've got a bad engine. And... Hello, Ollie. Well, don't bother with old Bessie. She's no use to anybody. Hey, Bazza, that's not very nice. Oh, he's right. Bessie's burgers used to be the best in town. But ever since Polly's pizza parlour opened up, I lost all my customers. Oh, dear. Yeah, no one wants a banger from an old banger. Ah, hey, Ollie. Get it? Well, maybe not bangers or burgers, 
but I've got a great idea for you, Bessie. Hey, you two, why don't you open a roadside cafe? Using Bessie here to cook all your lovely health food. Health food? Yeah. I'm off to the beach for some ice cream. See you later. So, what do you say? Well, I don't see why not. We won't have to find a shop for my cafe. She'll need a good clean-up first, mind. Oh, you'll have no complaints from me there. Well, let's get to it then. Oh, how wonderful. But will this really work? You see, I feel so mucky and messy. We'll take good care of you, Bessie. You're gonna be my roadside cafe. Come on, this will be a great laugh. We're gonna grease those rusty wheels. Ooh, I can't tell you how good that we're going to fix up this old door. Don't stop it there. I want more. How about a fresh coat of paint? Oh, yes. I really cannot wait. We'll make you sparkle and shine. Oh, I say. That suits me fine. We fixed up our old Bessie. Cos she got a little bit messy. So good to hear you laugh. <laughs> and I will be your roadside cafe. There you go, Farmer Dan. One ploughman's lunch. Oh, I bet you can't wait to plow your way through that. <laughs> oh, Jethro. Oh, it looks like your roadside calf idea is going to be a great success, Ollie. Hey, what's going on here? Oh, who's cooking that food? That'll be Bessie, helping to cook all that healthy food you like so much. <laughs> oh, it smells great. Now, now, Buzzer. Back of the queue with you. You can wait your turn just like everybody else. Oh, 